Hey kids, Lego Puppy Steve here. And today, I'm coming to you from one of the roughest, toughest places to be found in a Pathfinder Battle playset. And a lot of this stuff is found in this playset right here called the Rusty Dragon Tavern. Aw, oh, cool, just look at all the cool stuff you get. And we get really cool furniture, a table, chairs, barrels, more barrels, bottles, and tables to put in your cool playset. All right, now that's what I'm talking about. No, all we need is a waiter. Hello, welcome to Zombie Steve's bar. <laughs> Zombie Steve? Thank you, come again. <sighs> well, what you be drinking, stranger? All right, Zombie Steve, give me one of those sarsaparillas. All righty, one sarsaparilla coming up. I just love me some root beer. Greetings, patrons. I hate to come to you in my hour of need, but these lands are being terrorized by tons of monsters. I need some fearless warriors to accompany me in battle so we can vanquish all that destroy our land. Oh my gosh, Zombie Steve, do you know who these guys are? These guys come to us straight from this really cool Pathfinder Battles playset called Iconic Heroes. And in this set, we get Red Raven, the human vigilante. We get Sova, which is a shapeshifter. Raviani, the human psychic. Eric, the human noble, and the mesmerist Melecaster. And of course, they're asking me to battle with them. Hey guys over here, we'll help you. Ah, oh, that is fantastic news. Thank you, my friends, for wanting to join us in battle. Together, we will make a difference. And here I just thought this was a line for the bathroom. Hey Deadpool, stay focused. All right, men, time to move out. We're going up the mountain to visit the sacred pool and pillar set. Ooh, all this climbing's getting me dizzy. Up the mountain we go. And once reaching the top of the mountain, we find all these cool pieces from the pools and pillars set. Aw, oh, man. And this set has all kinds of cool items. We get these cool pillars, cool rocks, rock formation with a pool in the middle. Aw, oh, neato. We also get three reflective pools. We also get rocks and even decorations like uh, this moose head here. <laughs> Banners or even torches. Wow, cool, I thought of everything. Now we just need some monsters to slay. Get ready, gang, it begins. Oh man, and these monsters come to a straight out of the classic creatures pack from the Dungeons and Dragons playset. Oh man, just look at all these guys. And this playset gives us these little mermen here. We also get orcs. We also get this owl bear monster, which is half owl, half bear. You can't forget this guy, the Ogre Mage, which is uh, an Ogre Mage. <laughs> but nothing can compare to the giant Demi Gorgon! Rrr, I'm going to destroy the land! As well as the giant Worm! Oh, yuck! Oh, look at that giant worm! He's gonna go through the land and destroy it too! Uh oh, I think we're a little outmatched here! Come on, we must go fight Puppet Steve! Uh, I think I just pooped myself. Oh, gross, Deadpool! Keep it to yourself! All right, you. Stop right there, or I will kill you. Oh no, there are too many of them. Oh man, this is no good. We need reinforcements. If it's reinforcements you want, then it's reinforcements you'll get. <laughs> oh, look at this. And these are these cool things called wardlings. Oh, check this out. We get a boy druid with a tree companion. Oh, I love it. A boy cleric with a winged snake. Ooh, a boy fighter with a dragon dog. And a girl wizard with a genie. We get a girl with a lynx. And last but not least, a girl rogue with a badger. All right, let's check out this boy druid with a tree companion because we just love tree companions. Oh, you just gotta love that. That's a tree companion worth having around if you ask me. Oh no, but here comes that giant worm! Woodlings, attack! Alright, Mr. Worm, you're going down! Ha ha, we win! Death to the monsters! Oh, and just look at this battlefield! Oh man, it's all full of dead monsters! Alright, and the day is saved thanks to Puppet Steve! And the Wardlings! Yeah, but uh, mostly Puppet Steve. Yeah. <laughs> We had one heck of a battle here. And if you want to keep up on all the adventures in the Dungeons and Dragons world, then just check out this super cool book, which is called Morden Kane's Tomb of Foes. Wow, check it out. This is a super cool book that has all kinds of quests inside that you can undertake in the uh, super cool world. Ooh, look at that guy. He's a big old dragon. And we've got demons and big old 
Moloch's there? Ugh, oh, gross. And look at that, we've got tree people, fire people, uh, what is that? Ice people? <laughs> oh, look at that guy, oh, he's a rhinoceros, uh, hippopotamus guy. Ugh, oh, gross. Yep, there's all kinds of cool artwork in this book, and, uh, even this guy. Which, hey, wait a minute, that looks kind of like one of the guys in our party. What? That looks nothing like me. Yeah, sure it does. Anyway, talk about a super cool book. This book has it all. Dwarf adventures, and a dark reflections, like, uh, oh, then a reflection pool. And ooh, look at these creepy pictures. Zombies, and more zombies. And what is this, The Walking Dead? <laughs> all right, kids, well, there they are. All the really cool figures and action figure scenes that you can get from Pathfinder series and Dungeons and Dragons. Awesome. Hey kids, please help out our Puppet Steve channel by subscribing to us, because we're trying to get to 500,000 subscribers by the end of this summer. And the new Puppet Steve store is here. And this summer, you can buy t-shirts and more. As always, thanks for watching, kids.